Hi, Mortal Kombat fans! This is Asmian Anta, back with another video. So let's take a look some behind the scenes footage. It's pretty interesting to see the actors between the action scenes or dialogues. Okay, let's go. Fight! <laughs> Here we have Cabal and Liu Kang, Daniel Nelson and Ludilene respectively. Louis Stan, Joe Taslim and Hiroyuki Sanada are relaxing. Watch at the Cole Young's outfit. It's his powerful movie armor. But in this shot, it's not so powerful. And this is Liu Kang meditating. I wonder what he thinks about. And here Ludilin is just posing or showing off. Well, this is Liu Kang after all. He's cool anyway. Please welcome Hiroyuki Sanada with one of the assistant directors, Chris Webb. This is a shot of the famous scene where Scorpion says his famous phrase. I mean, get over here! And now I'm going to tell you, I guess, a historical date. September 4th, 2019. The first time Joe Taslim fits Sub-Zero's costume. The first time they became one. Amazing. By the way, costume designer is Cappy Island. She and her team were dedicated to bringing the iconic outfits from the game to reality. Actress Mel Johnson as wing vamp Nitara. And here she is with Kung Lao Max Huang. Now this photo was taken from the scene of Kung Lao's flight on Nitara's back before his brutal flawless victory. By the way, his song is called exactly the same. I mean, flawless victory. And this is how Mel Johnson turns into Nitara. This character has so little screen time, but so much makeup work. This is first image of Kun Lao. This photo was taken when Max Wang first tried the whole outfit of this character. Amazing. And how about this? Poor Jax. Liu Kang wins. Paperality. Or maybe friendship. Whatever. This photo shows Cole Young, his daughter Emily Young, and Melina. And in this funny video, Melina trains for a fight scene with Sonya Blade or Cole Young. As you can see, she's pretty good. A real warrior of the art world. Outstanding. <laughs> okay, I'm just kidding. And this photo was made after shooting that amazing scene with Bihan, Harumi and Jubei. Yukiko Shinohara, director Simon McWoyd, Joe Taslim and Ren Miyogawa, who made an awesome debut as an actor in this film. He played Hanzo's son, Jubei. And how about this? Sub-Zero, Liu Kang, Reiko, Melina and Cabal, played by Joe Taslim, Ludi Lin, Nathan Jones, Sissy Stringer and Daniel Nelson respectively. Pretty funny photo. Just look at Joe. And this is Sissy Stringer. She gets Melina's makeup. As you know, then these scars will be painted over. Sub-Zero and Lord Raiden. Joe Taslim and Tadanobu Asano, enemies in the movie, but good fellows in life. Here are the on-screen enemies. Big guys, Major Jax and General Reiko, McCat Brooks and Nathan Jones. As you can see, Brooks is in a blue sleeve for CGI. <laughs> and this is Louis Tan in his armor. I think he shows us how cool he is. Maybe, maybe not. Honestly, I wish he also had an armor mask in the film. I think it would be better. And here the actors Louis Tan and Joe Taslim are putting pieces of fight on their bodies after the grueling fight scene at the end of the movie. So ironic for Sub-Zero. This picture featured Hiroyuki San, Louis Tan and Joe Taslim's son Hiero. He told his father that he is a huge fan of Scorpion. Well, that's funny, because his father is Sub-Zero. And here Ludilin trains his fight scene with Cabal. And this is Cabal's designers. One designed his mask, the other his outfit. He looks so amazing. That's fire. Maybe this full mouth dude was the dopest bad guy in the movie. After Sub-Zero, of course. And maybe Kano. By the way, Kano. That's how Josh Lawson trained. A little boxing. Not bad. And here's Jessica McNamee training with Nina Pila to play Sonya Blade's character in the movie. Would you like to see some of Cabal's training? Here you go, Daniel Nelson. They are all boxing. And this is Max Huang doing his famous move, which Kung Lao did a couple of times in the movie. 
And how about US Special Forces with Major Jackson Briggs and Lieutenant Sonia Blake? We saw some of these shots in Sonia's house. To protect and to serve. And this is Sissy Stringer as Melina for the movie poster. Daniel Nelson as Cabal and Chin Han as Shang Tsung on set. Nathan Jones as General Reiko and Simon McWord as director. Feel the power. And once again, Cole Young, who takes off his armor costume. It's probably a little hot. Here is Daniel Nelson with Liu Kang's stunt double Tyson Tran. Yes, Cabal loves to be photographed. He's everywhere, just like all the others. I'm guessing he's one of those guys who stole the show. And here's how Joe Schlossen becomes Kano, with a little help from the makeup department headed by Nikki Gulli. Look at Nathan Jones and his hammer. Look how tall he is. Really big fella. General Reiko. And this is Max Huang meditating a little before shooting. Jessica McNamee and Taranova Asano on set. As you can see, this is extremely difficult and complex fight scene with Goro. For those who don't know, Goro is that guy in blue. This is behind the scene where Goro hit Cole Young with the door. By the way, do you want to see Goro? Here he is. Prince Benny. And this is famous pit location behind the scenes. Sub-Zero and Jax. Fatality in the movie, but friendship behind the scenes. Friendship. And how about stunt doubles? Here you go. Ben Simmer as Kano and Josh Lawson's stunt double. Tara Mackin as Melina and Sissy Stringer's stunt double. Zia Kelly as Sonya Blade and Jessica McNamee's stunt double. Gareth Hatfield as Cole Young is waiting for something. Want to see more? Then just go to watch my video about stunt doubles of the Mortal Kombat movie. Excellent. And this is Mortal Kombat family on the last day of filming. Actor Max Wang, who plays Kung Lao, always had a camera during filming. And selfie, of course. Making a movie is not complete without selfies. Well, that's all. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, subscribe, and see you next time. Bye!